bless you this evening. Amen. Let's bow our heads. And let's talk to the Lord. Oh Father. We have no other place to run to. Our God is an awesome God. It says casting all our cares upon him. For he cares for us. Heavenly Father. We come to you. We are humbled. We cannot even look up to you. How great, how holy, how wonderful you are. But in all we find that you are merciful. Yes. And you are gracious. Oh Lord. You are gracious Lord. Even if you visit iniquity upon the children, of the fathers upon the children to the fourth, third and fourth generation, your mercies endure it to a thousand generations, Amen. even forever. Amen. Lord, thank you. Thank you for everything that you have done. We glorify your name. Lord, we celebrate this fellowship, Lord, with the Lord Jesus Christ. Thank you for the grace that is in the name of Jesus Christ and the power thereof. As we gather to thy word, Lord, may you bless us. Remind the fire. Yes. Blessed be you forever. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. Amen. Lord bless you, rich man. In the name of Jesus Christ. We're here this afternoon or this morning to about a few minutes before the end. Amen. 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 The engineer came to site the poles, the poles that will direct this place upward. And the Lord grant us grace in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Uh, Brother Charles Obong has landed safely in Kampala. You know, we were enjoying ourselves. He had a three month visa and he had a six weeks ticket. But the immigration officer, when they entered, gave them only one month each. We didn't take those. So immediately I said bye bye and he entered where we are separated. There's no need for us to wait because we have done everything. He has cleared with the police, SSS, customs, drug law enforcement agency. He has cleared with the bomb and quarantine. Health. So get him to the immigration where he had to pull his shoes and his belt. The father of the, the visa or his stay. The visa had not expired, but his stay had expired. So they arrested him. And there was no way he could contact me because he had no local SIM card. He has returned the SIM card back to Pastor Billy Joseph. And you know, it's a pity that Nigerians don't honor servants of God. Amen. This person is not here for business. I know if it was in Congo, they would let him go. If it was in Uganda, they would let him go. If it was in Kenya, they would let him go. God's will and I, we were in Kenya, they expected us to pay a particular amount of money. We didn't have the money. They let us go. In the name of Jesus Christ, they let us go. So when you see strange things happening to this country, don't blame them. Don't pity too much. They dragged the man, took his money. They took his money. Amen. And then they let him go. We thank the Lord. Amen. Praise the Lord. The thing that, uh, so we are going to talk to our sister, the Sarum also, in the Foreign Affairs Office, so she will help facilitate that of Pastor Nukuru, so that we don't have a petition of that. Amen. Praise the Lord. But I don't know how our immigration works. 
when a ticket is six weeks, you are given a one month visa. I mean, a one month stay. It's not done. This is not the first time we are bringing people in. The Congolese, they came here. They, they, they stayed, the Rabbit just stayed for uh, almost three months. Three months. The Congolese brothers, they stayed for two months. And they, they stayed according to their tickets. The most important thing that people should, the immigration should check, is that the ticket and the, and the visa, that the, the ticket to go back does not go back when the visa is expired. But we find the law. Satan just did that a waste of time. Amen. Praise the Lord. So, it is not a good thing, uh, but however small money we took from our brother, it is good as we contribute that money and send it. Amen. Amen. The Lord be blessed. For it is your uncles at the airport that took the money. <laughs> Amen. Praise the Lord. Amen. Say that will be good. Chop will be young. It will concern you. That's what that's why he looks like. So we find the Lord for that. Hallelujah. But we cannot quantify that with the testimonies that we have. Amen. And we prayed for somebody here. Was it on Sunday? On Sunday, about the man that was paralyzed and uh, not speaking. Amen. So the sister called me today for John. Said, Oh, Pastor, I'm thanking God because the man has started talking. He has started speaking. Amen. Can we wave our hands to the Lord Jesus and say, Lord, you are worthy, receive all the glory as you have done it. Take the glory and perfect it in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. Praise the Lord. Our God is an awesome God. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Uh, I'll be speaking this evening on a call to worship. A call to worship. An invitation to worship. Praise the Lord. Now, this message is coming because uh, after storm comes what? After the storm, after the rain, the sunshine will come. Praise the Lord. But what about those that have been carried away by the storm? What about those that have allowed themselves and the wind has blew them away? Amen. Amen. Praise the Lord. Uh, Pastor Lokoro will be going to Ijoko tomorrow. Amen. Yeah. But I think he will be there till Tuesday or so. Then he will be having just one week remaining. It's almost finished. Praise the Lord. So if you missed the man, if you missed a born chance, don't miss Brother Lokoro. He's our champion. Amen. Praise the Lord. You read that we are organizing a convention in Kotido. Kotido is, like I said, a border, a border of the, the beginning of the entry, entrance into the Karamojotam. So it's easy. Amen. Praise the Lord. Where the only hard thing there is that the water is red. But there is water there. Amen. So we are going there for convention. And I want five people from here to attend that convention. 
Jesús está escondido por las. Es está hostil. They are clapping for you already. Um, of course, you choose right. But I should have an answer. Amen. And then you meet sisters who will give you a handshake, you will cry. <laughs> but the first time I went to Cambodia, they shake my hand and I and tears gather in my eyes. <laughs> because I had a little pain in the hand. And they were so happy when they held the hand and they shake it. I was I was just dancing. <laughs> Amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Amen. So much. Lord, if you want God to bless you, get into a project for the Lord. Amen. Amen. For me, when I sit down, then maybe there is no money in my hand. I just desire to bless somebody. I desire to bless the ministry. I desire to do something for the Lord. It's not mine. Lord, is for you. At least he will give me a chance for money to reach there. Is that not so? Uh-huh. Praise the Lord. Amen. So if you go to a Korea company to carry something for you, you at least pay some charges. If you transfer an, 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 an amount of money from a bank, you pay bank charges. Is that not so? Praise the Lord. Amen. 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 The Lord bless you, Richard. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Habakkuk chapter 2. We should stand, read the song of Habakkuk. Before Zephaniah, after Nahum. Amen. We shall read from verse 1 and terminate at the last verse 20. And we shall read it alternately. Please let's rise to our feet. Lord, the word of God. Stand for God, He will stand for you. Amen. I will stand upon my watch and set me upon the tower and watch to see what He will say unto me and what I shall answer when I am approved. Are we in fellowship? Yes. We wait one for another. Read verse 2 again because I didn't hear what you read. And the Lord answered me and said, Write the vision and make it plain upon tables that he may run that written it. For the vision is yet for an appointed time, but at the end it shall speak and not lie. Though it tarry, wait for it, because it will surely come. It will not tarry. Amen. Yea, also, because they, he transgresseth by wine, he is the proud man, neither keepeth at home, who enlargeth his desire as hell, and is as death, and cannot be satisfied, for gathered unto him all nations, and heaped unto him all people. (laughs) 
shall they not rise up suddenly that shall bite thee and awake that shall vex thee and thou shalt be for booties unto them? Because thou hast spoiled many nations, all the remnant of the people which shall spoil thee, in the words of men's blood, and for the violence of the land, and of the city, and of all that dwell there. Woe to him that covereth that converted an evil covetousness to his house, that he may set his nest on high, that he may be delivered from the power of evil. For the stone shall cry out of the wall, and the beam out of the timber shall answer it. Behold, is it, is it not of the Lord of hosts that the people shall labor in the very fire, and the people shall weary themselves for very vanity? For the earth shall be filled with the knowledge of the glory of the Lord, as the waters are covered as the sea. Woe unto, the he, unto him that giveth his neighbor drink, that putteth thy bottle to him. And maketh him drunken also, that thou mayest look unto their nakedness. Thou art filled with shame for glory. Be thou also, and let thy first sin be uncovered. And thou from the world's right hand shall be turned unto thee, and the shameful spirit shall be on thy glory. For the violence of Lebanon shall cover thee, and the spoil of the beast, which made them afraid because of men's blood, and of the violence of the land, of the city, and of all that dwell therein. Go on to him that said to the wood, Awake! To him, to the dumb stone, Arise! He shall teach. Behold, it is laid over with gold and silver, and there is not breath at all in the midst of it. Verse 20 again. But the Lord is in his holy temple. Let's sing that song if you know it. The Lord is in His holy temple. The Lord is in His holy temple.
with the Lord. For the Lord is in his holy temple and the temple of God is the body of man. Correct? Yes. Then he goes to say let all the earth what does he mean by all the earth? Whatever is earthly whatever is challenged Whatever is opposition, whatever does not give glory to God, whatever is against the wind of God, the east wind of God, let such keep silence before Him. Praise the Lord. Amen and amen. Amen and amen. Now, watch. If God did not stumble to make the body of man, the heart of man, his temple. Then, if he did not just stumble at it, then if God had had a pre-knowledge that he would dwell in man, then I believe that God must have had a preparation, not of himself, but of the place that he was going to dwell in. Ephesians chapter 1 verse 4 tells us that. Amen. What does it say? According as he has chosen us. Will somebody read that for me? Ephesians chapter 1 verse 4. Four. Is somebody reading? According as he had chosen us in him before yes. the foundation of the world. Yes. That we should be holy and without blame before him in love. He has chosen us before the foundation of the world that we should be holy. Now listen to this. Put it this way. According as he has chosen us in him before the foundation of the world in love that we should be holy before him. Praise the Lord. You see how I read it? Amen. Amen. Are we in this class? Please respond. Nobody comes to God by accident. Nobody looks for God. 
Where do you begin to look for him? In Lagos? In Israel? In Iraq? In Australia? Where do you begin to look for him? So nobody looks for him. The Bible says that his ways are past finding. Praise the Lord. But you see, God, the great Elohim, who knows all things before they be, who made all things that exist, for in John chapter 1, verse 3, it is written, And nothing was made that was not made by him. Nothing was made except through him or by him. Praise the Lord Jesus. Amen and amen. So watch this. Amen. Now, at every season, when a child is born, the child will have some obstacles to cross. Amen. If it's a boy, child is born, as they do till now, when he gets to eight days, they will circumcise that child and he's going to cry. Is that correct? Mm -hmm. And he will suffer that for days. He has crossed his death. Praise the Lord. Mm -hmm. As they are continuing, continuing, then the teeth began to come. As African believes, they say when the teeth start to come, the child starts to stew. But the white people don't believe that. For me, I believe the Africans. I'm with you all the way. <laughs> Amen. 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 If my prophet had told me that all that is supposed to do is to destroy, it's for destruction. You take a tablet when you have a headache and the headache goes, it has spoiled something else in your body. Amen. So let's leave that for another day. Are you following me? So the child begins to cross certain obstacles until some parents, when their babies are still babies, they are afraid. They don't know whether to survive. Is that correct? Yes. yes. Because at that point, the child does not need water and tell him it's water. It's a miracle that the mother can relate with this child. Now, education does not work in that place. Yes, so. That's why God, Amen, is the God of all flesh. Yes, amen. He takes care of those who do not even recognize Him. I told you a story how I was traveling from Uganda, Kasese, from Kasese to Bailey in Congo. And those of those people of, of uh, Koyin, they crossed the line in the night. Heavy shooting. You see, when they are shooting bullets in the night, do you know what you see? Fire. You see fire. Tip, 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 tip. Very fine. <laughs> it just goes like ah, ah. You just think it is it is knockout they are doing. Now a mother left the, the son when they were scrambling, they scattered the person to come up Because Koya, when they cross the any line, when they catch people, they will take the people with them. If you drag with them, they cut off your lips. Just cut off. 
or they put gold, put gold here, and put bad luck. That's the, it's the most terrible force, rebel force that we have ever seen. They cut off, they just hold it and say, which mouth you take, split. Then they say, smile, you are ever smiling. Because your teeth might be this. And maybe during this time, I'll show you some of those pictures, some of the victims. I have some of the pictures. You, you, you will not eat, choose. What they do to women and children, like God. They are soldiers, I want this one, but they don't want to listen, they are just sleeping. So they are responsible for it. Wicked, their heart is turned to the back. Amen. Amen. Praise the Lord. Amen. But you see, it is to you that somebody is lost. If you are watching a film, a movie, somebody is at the back of the door, and the other man comes looking for the person. This person does not know where this person is. But you that they were watching, you know. You know what yeah. You will say, don't go there, don't go there, don't go there, hey, 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 hey. <laughs> you have forgotten that it is that they are, they are acting. Yeah. This life also is acting. Yeah. Are you listening to me? Yeah. God had foreknown things before they happened. Yeah. If it is not so, he is not God. Amen. Amen. That is why prayers, worship, praises, preaching must be according to his will. Amen. So. There's something that is happening only in this part of the world. They say that. Somebody say, the Lord called a person, and the person said, God has called me, and he stopped being productive. He stopped thinking. But when God called you, he did not remove your brain. When God called you, he did not touch your hands. When God called you, he did not cripple you. Amen. Amen. And God is a walking God. He's a walker. He walks. My father walketh. He that told I walk. Are you following me? God wants creative people because he's a creator. If you are a missionary, for example, you are a missionary, You should at least, even without learning it, know how to build a house. Without learning it, what if you have you fall in a place? How many of you read the story? Uh, what I can it was an old story of one Robinson Crusoe. Remember that again? Anybody remember Robinson Crusoe? Yes. You remember? You read something about it? Who read about Robinson Crusoe? The man who was traveling and the ship wrecked. And only him fell on the island on an island. And he was there many years. I think he was there until more than more than ten years. Praise the Lord. 
Some people just die. Now you are dying because you don't know your Bible. You say there is no food. Who told you that there is no food? There is food. You fell on the island and there are fishes there. Crabs. Seafood. Not only that, he has bush, plants and little forest there. Any fruit you see in this world that has seed cannot kill you. No seed is poison. I'm not telling about leaves. I'm telling about seed. Any fruit at all you see, anything you see, you never eat it in your life. Once you take it, crack it open. If you have seed, eat it. Nothing will do you. It is food. It's written in your Bible. Amen. Your hands is your power. Your outward power is in your hands. What you can be able to achieve. Touching things. Praise the Lord. Amen. Now God has foreknown all things. But if we now sit down and say, God know what I will become. So I just sit down there. I'm waiting for God. God knows that pa, 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 I will grow. Pa, 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 I will go and pa, 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 I will sit down here. Pa, 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 they will come and give me a professor. Pa, 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 I don't need to read. Pa, pa, pa. Are people not thinking like that? <laughs> Somebody called me from Kaduna. Hey, Pastor Nice! Uh, they say you are sorry, sorry, sorry. They say you are not better. I was keeping my question. Hey, hey, why are we even preaching self? I saw in the scripture, Jesus said, No man comment unto me except my father and draw him, and I will raise him up. So, so Pastor, as I want to tell you that I fully understand that revelation. So now, for me, I just sit down at home. The father will be drawing them. <laughs> I said, brother, in the first place, I don't know when you became a minister. <laughs> Amen. Amen. Praise the Lord. Amen. You'll be sitting at home and your father will be drawing them. Amen. Praise the Lord. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Glory be to God. Amen. Now, let's come look at things. Romans chapter 8. Amen. Romans chapter 8. Are you there? Let somebody read for me from verse 5. And terminate in verse 8. Romans chapter 8, verse 5. For they that are after the flesh do mind the things of the flesh. Yes. But they that are after the spirit, the things of the spirit. Yes. For to be carnally minded is death, but to be spiritually minded is life and peace. Mm. Because the carnal mind is enmity against God. Mm. For it is not subject to the law of God, yes. neither indeed can be. Wow. So then, they that are in the flesh cannot please God. Mm. Praise the Lord. Now, how does that relate to the scripture we read in Habakkuk? Go to Habakkuk. Go to Habakkuk. And read chapter 2, verse 4. I want you to compare and find something there. Habakkuk 2, 4. Behold. Behold, his soul which is lifted up is not upright in him. Yes. But the job shall live by his faith. Now, watch something. There is a comparison here between the faith of the just and the soul of the proud. 
This was first man is Canaan. And the sign of carnality, you find competition. Do you know what competition has done to families? Families that are supposed to stay together and build, they competed and died. In your mother's womb, you hear that kind of thing. In your mother's womb, in your in your father's house, in your father's house. But look at Israel. When they identified one man, they did not care where which tribe he came from. Do you know that Israel were tribe by tribe, different tribes? But when they identified Saul. All of them supported Saul. When they identified David, all of them did what supported David. They never cared which person, which whose father was his father, who was his mother. But they identified. One time, Saul gave a command that nobody should eat or drink until they are fought and destroyed the enemy. And when they were fasting, and fasting because it was not by the will of God. They became so tired they could not fight. Are you following me? Sister Kinsley? Are you following me? Or are you following that? Thing? Amen. Praise the Lord. They become tired. They could not fight. But Jonathan, as he was going with his own armor bearer, he saw a honey that dropped. He took his spear there and tested the honey. And anointing came upon him. And he alone killed more than a lot of people, enemies. Then Saul now said, that is law must stand. They say, to all Israel, Moses said, you cannot do to bring this to your law. This is the man that brought us victory, salvation, deliverance today. You are will not touch him. They did not care whether it was Saul, Saul. But they cared because he was a deliverer. Canality. Flesh does not allow people to receive something from God. i give you an example. There are people who sit down to plant testimony before they receive miracles. <laughs> when we are going to the Apostolic Church, that time they will say, let us stand up. They will carry their Bible like this. Everybody carry Bible like this and pray. We used to like to carry our Bible up and pray. Then they say, they swore. They call it, thank you. So, let's pray. Pray what God will do for you this year. Somebody in my front just shouted, God, I want you to give me that car so that I will drive it to the village and pour water on that useless man. He mentioned the name. <laughs> and he prayed it seriously. <laughs> He did not say to him to say. <laughs> <laughs> if, now, if, if, now, God is the owner of the rain that we fall. And the earth, we have to cooperate to dig him so that water will stay for him to come and pour. He didn't calculate all of this. But now, he's already told how he wants to give his testimony to the detriment of others. A soul that is lifted up is not upright in him. But the just shall live by his faith. Now, if faith is revelation, shall we read it again? The just shall live by his faith. If faith is revelation, the just shall live by his revelation. Praise the Lord. Amen. Are you following me? Amen. Amen. So now, we are still in Romans chapter 8. As we are still going on in that place. Watch verse 14. Fourteen to seventeen. Romans chapter eight, verse fourteen. For as many as are led by the Spirit of God, yes, they are the sons of God. As many as are led by the Spirit of God. They are the sons of God. Now, it didn't say sons and daughters. 
Because here now, he's not talking about male and female. He's talking about position. In, in Christ, position is equal. What are we talking about? Position of salvation. There is no higher salvation and lower salvation. Amen. There is no higher deliverance and lower deliverance. A saved person is saved. Amen. Praise the Lord. Amen. We need to appreciate the salvation of God in our lives. Quickly, brother. Verse 15. For ye have not received the spirit of bondage again to fear, but ye have received the spirit of adoption, whereby we cry, Abba, Father. Amen. Verse 16. The spirit itself beareth witness with our spirit yes. that we are the children of God. Now, 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 wait. I need to speak something here now. Listen, if you walk to me and say, Pastor, I don't know if I have the Holy Ghost, you don't have it. And that's not enough for you to go and claim and say, Pastor, you know I have the Holy Ghost, you still don't have it. <laughs> Amen. Praise the Lord. The Spirit of God in you will witness to you, will bear your own spirit witness that you are not of the devil. Now, how does that happen? Is it a voice telling you that you are the child of God? No. No. Brother, it is the way you are able to be grieved when there is a wrong before you. Have you all seen children in school those days? I used to walk with some boys. I didn't know that they used to wear six nickel before they wear their school nickel. <laughs> and me, I just wear my own. Just, just. <laughs> then, you don't have to wear my evil deal. I will tell you one story today. Praise the Lord. Amen. It's not good to be wicked. I'm telling the story because he will consign this my sister. The person I want to mention bear the same name. That's why the day she mentioned her name, she said, Awa, Awa. I said, Hey, another Awa don't come. <laughs> <laughs> Amen. For good though. Now, they warn us when we go to school, we go early because we want to go and eat that woman's food. We will line up there. That they will cut their back. If you see, if the way they cut their back, is so attractive. They cut their back, their back will be like this. <laughs> my revelation, I'm show you. <laughs> so now you will cut the cut and small, they cut the side, they cut the cut. The side. <laughs> so we'll be going there, eating this thing, eating this thing, the soup. Then you know that when something is done for the public, hygiene is not guaranteed. Yeah. Is that correct? Yeah. The way tomorrow is that, don't be eating there, don't be eating there. Then the principal, not today, see schools. I'm mean, talking about government schools. The principal now sends spies. Spies. Girls and boys. Who don't who you don't use the they just came there. They just feel as if they are buying takeaway. And they mark us. <laughs> <laughs> At the assembly, and we're not late. We just came and say, How many of you are coming from the house straight? Everybody lift up your hand, we lift up. If you are coming from the house straight, drop your hand. Uh-uh. Now from Busha they come. <laughs> we drop our hand. Okay. If you hear your names. <laughs> Line. That is a different one. Those other ones. They are what? 6655. Five. Nika inside. Me innocent. You are following people to do it. We don't know the road. They brought us out. They flow back, 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 back. And there, me, I cannot even suspect those people that came. 
act, but my people who are criminal minds, they already suspect, they say, he low pass this person. But one day, something happened. I came, we ate that food, and I was feeling very bad. There was a girl in our class. They, she just came and they made her the class captain. Her name was Awa. And we hated this girl. <laughs> How can she just come from nowhere? Because they said she come from the army school. They don't make her. Our name will always be in. She, and she is not a to write our name for noise maker. And I knew that I hated her. But I could do, I could not do anything against her. I just left her but she can't cross my way. Then my old friends who they eat and my ego together. When the fever started in the class, I began to shiver. <laughs> then the it was the math sister that was there. Hey, our friend is not feeling fine. What did you eat this morning? I lied. I said it's tea and bread. <laughs> <laughs> oh, of course, I drank. My father gave me tea and bread, but I will not take that one so serious because I want to use the. We are keeping space for the. <laughs> <laughs> it was not so long. The man never go back to board. I lose. <laughs> they are so long. <laughs> Everybody run. <laughs> <laughs> but do you know the person that we hated because she was a class and she was the person that came and packed it. Now, well, when when I saw that I vomited, she now can't her mouth. Nothing do you. <laughs> My friend said, welcome, they don't go. <laughs> when I remember, I cried. <laughs> really, because I didn't wake up straight to the hospital. I didn't, it was in the hospital, I opened my eyes. My father now came. That one just said, if they told my father I vomited like that, he said, lie, lie, <laughs> my son. He said, right, no. Uh, they now say, they used to buy a kid. That one, I'm not going to double water for that body. Now, by the time I recover the fake from the fake sickness, so coming back to school, that girl, the, the father has taken her to another school. Uh, there was no way I could tell her, thank you. No, after all, thank God, say she go. Go ship. <laughs> Amen and amen. Now you see, such is life. Praise the Lord. Yeah. Amen. Amen. Back to what we are saying. Now, look at verse 16. The spirit in you bear witness with your own spirit that you are of God. Listen to this. Do you have a sin in your life that is hard for you to overcome? The secret is you are not confessing. Oh, but I confess it. No, it's not true. You make it open, it will leave you. You keep it secret, keep managing it, it will stay there. And that is the God that will bring you to this world. That does not stop you not to be a child of God. But it will stop you from sitting in his holy hill in the rapture of death. Why? You cannot be taken in the rapture with Satan's property. You are going to wait behind to give it to Satan since you can't give it to Jesus. You understand what I'm saying? Put that point down. Amen. Jesus will not take it from you at rapture. No. He takes it now. And how is he going to take it? You make it open. You make it open. That's why we need a spirit-filled church. Not a canal church. Not a church of tribes. Friendship and clubs and classes and groups. 
not to set a bunch of gossips and like men this way, women this way, boys this way, girls. No, we need a Holy Ghost filled church amen. that will be like, amen, amen. an army that is out to win, an army that keeps its own secrets, even our brothers when they go to fight or steal, and one of them is shot down, wounded, they will carry him. If they can't carry him, they will kill him. But the army does not kill his own. That's why right. Those bags of sand, soldiers carry. They carry it so that it becomes part of them. The day that they will be carrying a human being, it will be mountain. Praise the Lord. Our spirit, his spirit, bear witness with our spirit that we are children of God. Amen. Amen. Then read verse 17. And if the children, yes. And if children, then heirs. Now, now, listen to that. And if we are children, then we have inheritance. Because the inheritance goes to the heir. Amen. If children, then we are heirs. Heir. Now, there are many children. But among the children, there are heirs. Those who will do what? Inherit. Praise the Lord. We are talking about inheriting the victory. Praise the Lord. Come and inherit the power. Come and inherit the blessing. Come and inherit the goodwill of Jesus Christ. Then if children, then heirs. Yes? Heirs of God. Heirs of God. And join heirs with Christ. And join heirs with Christ. If so be that we suffer with him. Yes. That we may be also glorified together. Amen. Amen. Now why can't they just clean this place? What's this thing doing here? Please read it again. If so be that we are with him. That we may also be together. People don't want to see this. In Christ and us. <laughs> Praise the Lord. Amen. Jesus said, if they love me, they will love you. Are you following me? Alright. So now, we are continuing to get to where we are going to. Amen. Romans chapter 8, read verse 18, and let's stop at verse 22. Quickly. Verse 18. Yes. For I reckon that the sufferings of this present time are not worthy to be compared with the glory which shall be revealed in us. I have valued it. I have calculated it. Amen. Amen. The suffering of this present time. Brother, what are you suffering? The stress of this present time. But somebody could be careless and say, Lord, I don't want to know about the future. Now is the time. Bless me now or leave it. But to live is a blessing. The call to live life itself is a blessing. Keep reading, brother. For the earnest expectation of the truth for the, the creature waited for the manifestation of the sons of God. Mm. For the creature was made subject to vanity. Yes. Not willingly. Not willingly. But by reason of him who had subjected the same in hope. Because the creature itself also shall be delivered from the bondage of corruption into the glorious liberty of the children of God. For we know. For we know that the whole creation groaneth and travaileth in pain together until now. Stop. Now please listen to this. It is clear that we are acting in drama. By verse 20, read verse 20 again. It is clear that our life is a drama. For the creature, for the made subject to vanity, not willingly, but by reason of him who had subjected the same in hope. Stop. Are you a creature? Yes. 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 Okay. For 
for Brother Max was made subject to vanity, to suffer vanity, to see some waste time and delays, ups and downs, burial, fire in his house, his car, in fact, accommodation issue. Just, can you imagine? Not, not because he sinned, not willingly. Amen. Amen. But the reason is, there is one who subjected him, who pressed him down with hope. Amen. He tied hope on him and pressed him down. So it's like a man jumping into the sea with you. He will not sink. He will float. Isaiah 43. Can you open Isaiah 43? Isaiah 43, reading from verse 1. So what did he say there? He says, before we come back here, listen, the day problem come to you, the problem come because he sees solution in you. One. Yes, but now thus said the Lord. Now, listen, listen. Does does the sentence start with thus? Hello? Does the sentence start with thus? No. It means that there's something that has been going on. And the Lord said, but now. Somebody said, but now. But now. Whatever has been going on before, but now. Okay, said the Lord. Thus said the Lord that created thee. Oh, brother nice. Oh, Jacob. Okay. And he that formed thee. Yes. Oh, Israel. Fear not. Fear not. For I have redeemed thee. Stop. What is the word redeemed? I have bought you. I have paid. I have paid. You have been paid for. Amen. 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 And Whatever I pay for does not get lost. Where would the enemy hide it that the eye of the Lord will not see it? Say, be what? Redeemed. Oh, hallelujah. Amen. I have redeemed thee. I have called thee by thy name. I have called thee by thy name. Thou art mine. I want to tell you, you, are, you don't belong to sickness. I want to tell you don't belong to poverty. Amen. I want to tell you don't belong to failure. Amen. He said, I have called you by my thy name and you are mine. Amen. Now you listen to me. If you are, what is this, what is your name then? If I have called thee by thy name, thou art mine. The name is not Jacob. The name is not Israel. The name is Christ. Amen. That's why. Praise the Lord. Amen. Tell your neighbor, don't worry. Amen. Amen. Verse two. Verse two. When thou passest through the water, I will be with thee. Why? Amen. Because I tie you to with hope to go through the water. Yes. I'll put you around you. I'll put light jacket on you and I put you in the water. How can you sing? Yes. Hallelujah! Amen. Is this concerning somebody? Yes. All right. Keep going. And through the river, they shall not overflow thee. They shall not overflow thee. When thou walkest through the fire, wow, thou shalt not be burned. You shall not be burned. Yes. Neither shall all the flame kindle upon thee. You know why? You will not even smell smoke. 
You will not even smell smoke because I've wrapped you with hope. I've wrapped you with Christ. I've wrapped you with my power. I've wrapped you with glory. I've wrapped you with favor. I've wrapped you. If God did it for Joseph in the Old Testament, how much more will he do it for me in the New Testament? Verse 3. This one is interesting. For I am the Lord thy God. Aha. Uh -huh. The Holy One of Israel. Aha. Uh -huh. Thy Savior. Aha. Uh -huh. I gave Egypt for thy ransom. Stop. When it was clear that you should die, I substituted you. Amen. Praise the Lord. Amen. Brother, many people are there in your place. You don't know. You don't trust them. Believers, they die their own death. Nobody kills them. We don't believe that here. Nobody can kill any of us. It's not possible. Amen. And you won't die alone. Amen. 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 Praise the Lord. Amen. It's what the preacher preached at the funeral of my mom. That's all cry. Oh, oh, they're dying of Who is what 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 do you call your? The most important thing is that you fulfill your days. Yes. And do you know your days? It is with the Lord. Yes. So Solomon was 56 years old when he died. Solomon. He was 16 when he became king and he ruled for 40 years. 40 plus 16. 56. Praise the Lord. Amen. Amen. He took Pia and Sheba. Do you know Sheba? You know where Sheba is? It's part of Ethiopia, but that is the land of the Somalians. All that Somali land was under Ethiopia. If you look at them, they look the same people. Praise the Lord. Amen. Amen. Do you see that? <laughs> Get back to Romans chapter 8. You see, brethren, brothers and sisters, don't let the devil cheat you. When the Lord invites you to come, we're not going to punish our flesh. No. That we come here, pray together, sing together, rest, take fruits. Is that punishment? Is that what you call punishment? But to observe, amen, to observe and inquire before the Lord. Many of us, we have never kept our promise before the Lord. You say, oh Lord, I'm going to pray and fast for three days. You did it only one day. The rest days, you got stories. Satan is robbing you. Amen. Verse 22. 21 and 22. Join it and we read. Yes. Of the creature itself also shall be delivered from the bondage of corruption. Yes. Into the glorious liberty of the children of God. Wow. Verse 22. Mm -hmm. For we know that the whole creation groaneth and travaileth in pain together until now. Until now. Why now? Yes. And not only they, 23, yes. And not only they, but ourselves also, which have the first fruits of the Spirit. Yes. Even we ourselves groan within ourselves, uh -huh. waiting for the adoption, waiting for to the, the, the redemption of our body. You are not yet born again of your body. 
you are born again of the Spirit. Praise the Lord. It is your inner man, your soul that is saved. But your body is dragging. Amen. And the hour comes when that will take place. Because some people say that the seven thunders have been revealed to them and they are still going to join it. The seven thunders, they have the revelation of the seven thunders, they go to the hospital. Once we finish, even during this prayer and fasting meeting, it is the season. We are expecting an earthquake in this particular season. And I want you not to be careless. I will not speak so much. But I'm going to put up three dreams from different people. One of the sisters said, Oh, very nice, it's satanic. I reject the baptism that he baptized me. When he baptized me, I saw darkness. I believe in the Father, Son, Holy Ghost. I believe three persons in one God. That's the gospel I know. And that's the gospel I'll die with. But I reply, Dear sister, you know you are our lovely sister. I know Satan has touched you in the place that is supposed to touch you. Not today that is that. That's what I was writing out. I said, listen to me. For the ministers of Satan, they transform themselves to, to angels of light. So what do you think they will say to people concerning the angels of God? Amen. Amen. They will say that they are of darkness. Which Paul say? He says that the, the, the way of truth shall be evil spoken of. But, brother, may God grant you patience in your life. If, if you can have self-control, self-control, Abuse words that does not tear the body, it does not give you a mark. Somebody says something bad about you, it does not wound you. Now, but the problem is this when somebody says something bad to you, you yourself begin to wound yourself. You take it, you want to understand it, you want to explain it, you want to express it, you want to evaluate it. You want to simplify it, you will die. That person will come for your burial. <laughs> Maybe the person that said so has even forgotten. He said it and he has forgotten. Hallelujah. But after some time, there was a dream. Eh, sister is coming back. Please, 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 brethren, pray for me, pray for me. I'm still against God and His servant. Pray for me, pray for me. The dream I saw, even that place I didn't. Hey, 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 God, help me. Help my family. I say, sister, we never stop praying for you. When I wrote you that day, didn't I say that you were my sister? Rejoice in the Lord. I win my sister. Let's set up great shame. Praise the Lord. Amen. Amen. He's talking about groaning. In this period, brothers and sisters, Saturday, get your friends come to the church. Be orderly. We 
we begin to pray. I'm a pastor. Sunday, Sunday, Sunday. Which tradition is moving you? The Lord has invited us for a conference. Attend this one. Praise the Lord. Amen. The brothers, especially brothers, you're going to the office, go from here. Amen. Amen. Praise be the name of the Lord. So, brother, can you read now? Verse 24. Just wash it quickly. For we are saved by hope. Mm. But hope that is seen is not hope. Mm. For what a man seeth, why does he yet hope for? Mm. But if we hope, for that we see not, uh -huh. then we with patience wait for it. Oh. Yes. Likewise, the Spirit also helpeth our infirmity. Yes, sir, I'm going to. For we know not what we should pray, for as we ought, but the Spirit itself maketh intercession for us with groanings which cannot be uttered. Amen. Amen. People say it is tongues, speaking in tongues. Not true. Amen. It's not true. I'm not again speaking in tongues. I speak with tongues. The speaking in tongues is not a sign of the Holy Ghost, mm -hmm. which is speaking in tongues. Amen. Have you heard the Yoruba incantation when they are challenging themselves in powers, voodoo powers? Amen. The same old devil. Praise the Lord. Likewise, the Spirit also helped our infirmities. What are infirmities? That there are infirmities shows weaknesses, shows inabilities. Brother. When a Christian, you see a Christian that has never been in a situation to ask himself, Am I really truly serving God? He's not yet a Christian. They go a time in your life that you see that and say, No, wait, uh, is it truly, am I really serving God? It happened to Elijah. It happened to Moses. You see them running away, fleeing. I thought I was the one. I ran away. It happened to Brother Brown. But you see, the spirit will come to help their infirmities. That time they kneel down. They want to pray, but there are no words coming out. Nothing. What, 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 do they, what does she want to pray that she never prayed before? And now she felt it didn't work, so she's just there. <laughs> Do you have that song? Prayer is 
is the soul's sincere desire. Huh? Utterance. Do you have that song on my Prayer warriors in the Bible, all of us must pray. 
Nobody pray past you. You hear me? Nobody pray past you. You look at it. Each time we have a request, and I need to say, let us pray here. Testimony comes. Yes, so, which person pray at the call answer? He said, because it is pastor or <laughs> maybe your own new desire. Nobody pray past you. I see people lining up the man of God. They line up, oh, no, no, line. they line up enter bus stop in the in, uh, uh, Ifako, HIA. They line up enter bus stop. Line yourself for the line. Amen. 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 I don't know why they share money there. Amen. Praise the Lord. Amen. What would they line? They could not know the person of the house. What would they go do? Yeah, forget it, Chris. <laughs> You don't understand the man of God did it is for people. Is there, now they are still only one foot. <laughs> <laughs> have you seen Ragido? Prayer is the soul sincere desire. Amen. Brother Joseph, please play. I'm not staying much again. But I play with pastors who still can sing Do you get the key or the tune? Pray on in the soul. Sincere desire of God, all unexpressed, the motion of a living fire that trembles in the breath. I thought for that, please. Please, if you can't get it. Whenever you guess it, you sing it at home. You copy it and sing it at home. He said, you want to say? He said that it is the motion. It is the movement of a hidden fire. I was in India in 2005, my first time to go to India. As I entered the house where people were gathered, you can't shout. I'm just talking slowly to them about Jesus. And I pray, just those simple prayers. And somebody was healed. The woman has had one who go in trouble. And she was healed. And then the mother of the woman said, he asked because she was not interested. She was just sitting aside. Then when I went out, she asked him, I said, Who is this man? When he was talking. He looked as if I was sleeping. Fire was coming out of his mouth. Then when he was praying, the fire came so much. He said, Mama, your daughter is ill. He said, it can be true. Go and check her. Amen. Amen. It's not the one you are saying. It's the one that the spirit, oh, that we might feed this spirit. That we might feed this spirit with prayers and fasting. That we might feed this spirit with the word of God. You just bought a fuel, which is the word of God. Listen to the message. Read your scripture. And you are piling up heaps of fire. That will be praying on your behalf. You may not be a person that they see that you are praying. They say, but this man is not praying. But because you are heaping it down, something is happening under you. Let's sing it. Pray the soul sincere desire
going. Listen to me. Do you hear what he said there? Something happened. Somebody just messed you up. You look here. You look there. Nobody that you know. You just look up. He said that you are great. You didn't say anything. So excuse me, say, shut up, I get away from here. You just look like, look here. Nobody, nobody wants to hear you. You just look up. He said, you just glance up. None but God is there. The next one, brother.
all of features out of the Teach us, let's talk to the Lord. Lord, we submit ourselves. They just shall live by His revelation. We know not how to pray. If we don't know, not then now teach us. Oh, Father. Let us pray. Lord, let us pray with you. <laughs> It is speaking your word back to you for performance. That's just an aspect of it. It's not the whole of prayer. Because we mentioned performance. Somebody said, this morning said, have you ever done fasting to thank God? Fasting to thank God. Just to thank you for what you have done. You fast to thank him. Father, teach us. Teach us, Lord. A call to worship. A call to worship. A call to worship. Lord, help our revelation. Revive your work in this place. Many are discouraged. There are many people that are discouraged. And currently, I'm destroying them from spiritual things. Oh, Father, teach us how to pray. Oh, Father. Oh, Father. Oh, down by whom we come to God, the life, the truth, the way. The path of prayer, thy self and truth, Lord, teach us how to pray. I want us to pray. I thank the Lord. On three days ago, a sister, I was just saying that God can do something that passes your imagination. A sister went to the sky while she was pregnant. They saw just one child. And she went buying one thing for one child. When she got to the hospital on the day of delivery, she delivered the first, they said, wait, the second one. She delivered the second one, a boy and a girl. That's only God that can do that. God beat science to it. Let's thank the Lord. Lord, they thank you. The other sister from Ajebule, she delivered in the evening a baby girl. Then Sister Carol also delivered a boy and a girl just 10 hours apart. We see that God has been giving it to us in twos. Two, two, every time. Two, two. Now, if God is doing that in delivery, you should do that in your own life. You just appreciate Him. Appreciate Him. Lift up both hands to the Lord. Lift up both hands to the Lord. Let the Lord take both hands of yours. Let the Lord take both hands of yours. Say, Lord, with my both hands I praise you. With these two hands I worship you. With these two hands I bless you. With these two hands, Lord, Lord, be glorified. Lord, be glorified. Lord, be glorified. Lord, be glorified. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Heavenly Father. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Glory to your name. Glory to your name. Yes, Lord. We thank you. We thank you. We thank you. We thank you. Yes. Our pastor was sharing me a vision when he was praying for a brother here. And he said he saw fire burning, burning, like burning a bush. You know when the fire is burning a bush, it's ready now for what? For, for planting. That the Lord is about to plant in your life. Can we see that God can do it again? Yes, Lord. God can do it again. Amen. 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 Amen.